best for you. That's that's all I'm saying. But we got a guy here. His name is uh, Eric Corey. So we're gonna we're gonna bring Eric Corey on. Uh, Eric, what's up, man? Yo, what's good? Good to, good to see you, man. How you doing? Good. How are you, bro? I can't complain. What's up? What's good with it? Not much, man. Oh, I was just talking Canelo. about yeah, Canelo. Yeah. What, what 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 did you make of the fight tonight? I know I've spoken. Oh, I'm just saying. No, I, 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 just, I just hate when dudes come on, you know, dudes is offered $2.5 million and that's the show they put on, you know what I'm saying? I feel like they're robbing the fans, bro. Yeah, man. You can do more. You can do more than that, bro. Yeah, like uh, like I said, I, I wouldn't have any problem with him if he, if he just actually let his hands go and, you know, if he got knocked out because Canelo just threw a four-punch combination or something like that or caught him with a good shot, I'd be okay with that, but he didn't even try. So, but but did he quit or did the, did the coach quit? No, I think it was uh, – I think I think it was the coach that stopped it, and the and that commentator said he quit, and then I, I think that's what happened. I have to go back and look. Yeah. Either way, he got dominated. Yeah, he really did, and it's like we've seen you go out, bro. We've seen you go out on your shield before. It's like yeah, we know you can do that for a two point five million dollar fight. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying when, he, when he fought when he fought Eubank, I mean Eubank was tagging his ass, but like he, yeah. he, he threw punches against Eubank. Yeah, I don't want to see that dude again. I don't yeah. Me neither, man. He, he, he like he he's gonna need to freaking do a lot to, to, for me to want to see him ever fight again, bro. But you, but do you see anyone beating Canelo from one sixty to one seventy five? Or all right, let's say one sixty to one sixty eight. The only guy that I think below 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 one seventy five, the only two guys that I think have a chance are Demetrius Andre and Benavides. That's it. Yeah. I don't any, anybody else to me. That's why, like for me, like when I hear Plant or Saunders, like those are cool fights, but. I already know they're not gonna beat him. It's a waste of time. To me. Just get to the get the get to the fights that get to the fighters that could actually test Canelo and, and make him have to show everything that he has in his skill set. That's yeah. why I'm at with Canelo. But you see, Saunders got good feet though. That's the thing. Now struggles with good feet, so I don't know. It it could be an interesting. Fight. I'm not saying he's gonna go in there and get like dog walked or destroyed. I, I think it'll be a, a a good fight. I just with Saunders, my only problem with him, with him is is I don't I don't believe he has the punching power to keep Canelo honest. And when you don't have the punch power to keep Canelo honest. He's gonna walk you down and chop that body down, and yeah. I, I, I see that fight. I don't think he's gonna stop Saunders, but I, th- I think he'll he'll win like a one sixteen, one twelve type decision over Saunders, and 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 land a lot of body shots. Right, right, yeah. So that's so that's why Charlo might be more interesting because he's strong, he's ex- yeah, hella explosive, fast, and he got the boxing ability. I think. Yeah, I mean Jamal's got the size too. He got the size, the boxing ability. He he's athletic. He can throw punches from different angles. You know th- that that would be another one too. I I, I, I I always forget about Charlo for some reason. Yeah, Jamal I don't, Charlo, see, I don't, I don't see Canelo walking him down. That's not gonna happen. No, and then the question you gotta ask, right, is if he can't walk Jamal Charlo down down, then how is he gonna beat him? Because Canelo at his best is is, is a forward fighter. Right, he's gonna try to counter punch him. Charlo. Yeah. And Charlo's a pretty good counter puncher himself. You see how he's sending up the uh, uppercuts. Oh, he landed one of the greatest counter punchers I've ever seen when he uh, against Julian Williams. Remember that that, that 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 knockdown he got against Julian Williams? Yeah, yeah, that was heartbreaking for me. Oh, you're from Philly? Yeah, I'm from Philly. So I can actually, hear it in your uh, voice, man. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I think the Charlo fight would be a uh, counter puncher versus counter puncher fight. Yeah, it'd be a, it'd be yeah. it'd be a chess match. We 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 really see the boxing IQ of Canelo tested in that fight. And that's the thing. I think I definitely for sure Kenel's IQ is superior to Charles, for sure. Yeah. So. Yeah, I, I, I would lean towards Canelo in that fight. I, I I just think with him too, like to beat Canelo, right? To beat him, you're gonna have to you have to have a couple of things. I think you gotta have good footwork, number one. That's a that's a gimme. Um, you gotta have respectable punching power, like the kind of punch power that's it, you don't gotta knock him out, but you at least gotta be able to Keep him somewhat at bay, which is easier said than done. But you gotta, you gotta have something for him. If you have nothing, you lose. Exactly. And um, you kind of you, 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 you gotta really believe that you, that you can win. Because a lot of these guys, I don't think a lot of these guys that are fighting can all really think they can win. Like even like aside from the guys we already mentioned, like even a guy like um, like Danny Jacobs, like like Danny Jacobs is a good fighter, but like I don't think he really believed in his heart of hearts that he could beat Canelo. Mm. Mm. He didn't yeah. fight like it. If he if he believed it, he would have followed that conviction on the night. Yeah, he really did. Yeah, it's, oh. but that's kind of taken away from Canelo. I th- I think Jacobs he put on the best. I mean, he put on like eighty percent of him that night. Yeah, eighty five percent of him that night. It definitely wasn't the. It definitely wasn't the Jacobs that showed up to the Rosario fight. 
to the oh oh yeah yeah thank God it wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> well, I got love for I got love for 